Hi everybody, it's Mike the Muppet Modeler here, welcome back to my channel. Uh, good afternoon to you all, hope you're having a good day, a good week, good month, everyone's staying safe. Uh, yeah, so um, as always before we get started, just want to say a big thank you to all my subscribers and a massive thank you to the new subscribers as well. Um, hope you're enjoying the channel, hope you enjoy the videos, um, nothing special I know, but um, I do enjoy doing them and um, I enjoy making the models. As I've said before, um, I'm not sub uh, sponsored by anybody, all the kits, all the paints, glues, everything that I, that I have I buy myself or have them given as gifts for Christmas birthdays and things like that. So. Um, it's always good to see that people like the channel, subscribe, and um, please do so. If you watch a video, please don't forget to subscribe at the end of it. Hit the notification button, hit the like button, leave a comment, good or bad, it's all it's all good to me. So, um, as you can see, um, on the screen is the instruction manual for the F-18. Super Hornet by Ravel um, which I'm making at the moment and I must say it is terrible the kit is awful it really is shocking I've never ever in my time making models and I'm what I'm 52 now so and I've been doing them probably since I was about five or six maybe the first kits um, and I've never ever in my life seen this that as I will show you now that symbol there close openings with putty and sand down surface how many kits do you know of that actually put that in the instructions? It's terrible. And this. Where is it? There it goes. Remove flash. Well. But as you can see. On the actual kit itself. There was an awfully big gap. It's a chasm. It's like the Grand Canyon. It was awful to fill. Shocking. The fit was terrible. As this, the two halves of the body, the upper and lower, go to get well, go together. Had to force them together. As you can see. And still not proper still don't fit properly around the engine the um, exhaust shocking that's all there hasn't been rubbed down yet but as you can see again absolutely horrific I bought the kit a while ago I thought I'm going to really enjoy doing that I love large making large scale models but given my time again I don't think I would have bothered spending the money it's been absolutely horrible absolutely horrible it really is there's loads of flash ejector pin marks Everything is, it, as you go through, it's just, it's just awful. It really is. Terrible. There you go. Enough of that. Enough moaning. There's only going to be a short video today. Um, hopefully, by the time I get finished with it, um, it'll look a lot better than what putting it together is but we shall see about that 
um, and then once that's finished I will be cracking back on with the Panzer or the Panther should I say so well there you go guys like I said just a short video today just to have a little moan a little whinge and uh, I would say to anybody thinking about looking at this kit buying this kit I wouldn't bother I really wouldn't it's shocking it's terrible the worst reveal kit I think I've ever made anyway that said I shall see you all later enjoy the rest of your week and I'll upload another video very shortly thank you very much don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell thank you very much and see you soon bye